What's up guys, your boy Darkskin, and today we're going to be going over Naruto versus Sasuke, talking about who's better at what, who's better in general, going over everything Naruto and Sasuke um, that dropped for anniversary. Um, a lot of people have been wanting me to do this video and uh, just talk about who's better and what scenarios, what cases, and things like that. So um, yeah, let's uh, get into it. So starting off, we're going to go over... Um, just the raw stats and like uh, uh, elements so Naruto has 2600 HP Sasuke is 2300 HP and this is gonna be max duped max peeled all of it so um Naruto pretty much Naruto wins HP battle right he has 300 more give or take so but I mean 300 more once you've hit like 2000 is not that big a deal so you know there it is um, Naruto's vast range Sasuke short range but with Sasuke's Jutsu, he becomes long range. So, and Naruto's attack stats only 1500. So I'm gonna have to give that to Sasuke simply because, um, as a short range unit, having a 2800 attack stat is massive. Not to mention he can become long range too, which is pretty crazy. Now, as far as their elements, right, what they bring to the table, uh, Sasuke wins simply because. Um, the only negate type disadvantage units in body are an uh, impact and a regular banner unit, which isn't that crazy good. And then like Blazing Bash, Tsunade does kind of. So, you know, nothing crazy. With Naruto, uh, you have Kaguya and Madara who just got a limit break um, that negate type disadvantage. Not to mention Kaguya hits harder than Naruto. Not to mention Kaguya heals more than Naruto. So Kaguya is still... Um, so pretty much Kagi is holding Naruto back from being as good as he would have been, right? So I'm gonna have to give that to Sasuke. Now going on to abilities, um, and just talking about like what they do for them. Sasuke is the better unit, no abilities. Like if we're talking no abilities, Sasuke wins, 100%. No, no doubt about it. Naruto does not get extremely good until you get dupes. Now if we're talking max dupes, I'm gonna say it's pretty even or give the edge a little bit to Naruto, simply because that healing factor and damage reduction is pretty good. But Sasuke does have damage increases, right? So I can't just roll him out. So I'd say it's about even. Like, it'd be like Sasuke 9, Naruto 10, as far as max dupes. Now, without dupes, it'd be Sasuke 10, Naruto like 6 or 7. Like, and I'm sorry that people are gonna feel that way, but hey, that's just how it is, right? So, um, now that we got that out of the way, let's go ahead and go to Field and Buddy Skill. So, Naruto's Field Skill is boost heart attacks by 15 to 750. Sasuke's is 70% to 90% chance to uh, counterattack. Now, Naruto wins this one 100% because he is giving a 750 attack boost to units, debatably, if you use them correctly. Like, that's just insane. Like, you, that's, like, you, you almost cannot beat that. As far as a field skill, like 750 attack stat, that's the difference between Kaguya hitting for like 80k and hitting for like 100 plus k, right? So, like, Naruto wins that. Now, we're talking buddy skill, Sasuke wins. Because although attack boost by 300 is good, if you're healing 300 a turn, that's way better. That's, like, you you don't, like, just healing is going to be way better, right? As far as each turn, so... I'm going to have to give that to Sasuke. Naruto wins the field. And I'm not tallying this up. I'm just giving y'all general statements about it. So I ain't got no board or nothing with me. Um, going on to Jutsus. Right? So we're going to talk about this for a little bit. So Naruto's Jutsu uh, is AoE, vast range. Ignore substitution for all enemies in range. Eight times attack towards them, knocks them back. Sasuke's is... Um, it's like vast range, but it's like, y'all know what it look like by now. 3.5 times attack towards all enemies in range, knocking them back, changes your long, changes your rank to long for two turns, and, uh, let me go ahead and find this real quick. Yeah, changes your range to long for two turns, and restores two chakra. Now, for Jutsu, gotta give it to Sasuke, 100%. The reason why, and I know some people aren't gonna like this, but it's like, Naruto... Alright, he's cool and all. Vast range is cool and all. AoE is cool and all. Sasuke literally can do unlimited jutsus, right? He can do unlimited jutsus over and over non-stop, right? Now, like, you can't beat that. And he hits almost the whole map. Like, you cannot beat that, 
So, I'm sorry, but that's just how it is. Not to mention, he makes himself long range. So, now he's long range with a 2800 attack stat. And he has a 90% chance to counter. Like, that's crazy, right? That's, that's insane. So, uh, now that we got that out of the way, let's go to ultimate ultimate jutsus both of them are single target naruto's removes perfect dodge attack boost and barrier uh from one enemy ignore substitution with a 30 times attack to one enemy in range right sasuke's ult which uh is cut off uh let me scroll up can we find it all right well we ain't got to do all that to, to see his ult uh sasuke's ult is a um 17 times attack to one enemy in range uh, negates type disadvantage and gives you 10 perfect dodges for one turn now again I'm going to have to give this to Sasuke the reason why is because not only is he doing more damage number one like 17 times multiplier doesn't seem like much to 30 times but you got to realize Sasuke almost has a double the attacks that Naruto has so that's why um so yeah not only that but negating type disadvantage he can be used anywhere any raid any element Naruto can't right so um i gotta give that to sasuke not to mention the 10 perfect dodges for one turn is pretty nice um if it was like two or three turns it'd be a lot better but you know getting the one turn is still pretty nice right um now that we got that out of the way let's go to uh pvp pvp let me scroll up boom get it right there scroll up on naruto boom all right so pvp stats naruto 45,000 hp 2400 attack stat 307 speed sasuke 39,000 uh hp 4400 attack stat 264 speed it's easy to see naruto wins in health and speed sasuke wins in strength now i would say naruto wins in range but in pvp you're not worried about range right range is not your main focus not to mention sasuke um can change his range to long range change his range to long range after he jutsus he has a counter attack that's almost guaranteed and if you use his first ability he can potentially hit you for 10,000 damage which I've, I've shown in a video so check that out if you haven't already um so yeah as far as pvp goes i feel like naruto's health hp are better sasuke's range and strength is better now as far as jutsus and pvp i gotta give it to sasuke again uh, we're not going to really talk about ults, because if you get your ult, like, you're just slapping anybody. That doesn't even matter. But as far as Jutsus, I got to give it to Sasuke again. Like I said in the previ previously, he can Jutsu non-stop. Like, you don't stop Jutsuing, right? Like, that's insane. Like, it's, like, that's just crazy. I'm sorry, but that's just how it is, right? Now, going on to Sync Skills. And after Sync Skills, I'll give my last, you know thoughts on it so sync skills sync with hidden leaf nullifies jutsu seal sync with hidden leaf nullifies the mobilization both of these are low tier but uh, honestly i'd say it's equal because like i, I don't know I, I i honestly i'd give it to naruto i'd say because not a lot of people are mobilizing but a lot of people are jutsu sealing as far as pvp so i'd give that to naruto Sync with Uchiha, Sync with Ninja Alliance. I'm giving it to Sasuke. The reason why, there are a lot, when I say a lot, a lot of, um, there's a lot of Uchiha units in PvP. There's not that many Ninja Alliance units. Ninja Alliance is more catered towards PvE. And nobody uses Ninja Alliance units that much anyways. Sync with all except body, reduce damage by 10%. Sync with all except heart, re uh, restores 125 health. I'm going to give it to Sasuke because if you see, damage reduction is always good. But if you're syncing with units that are not heart units, 9 times out of 10, you're going to have like 6 path Naruto on the team and you're going to be healing. So you don't really need, that's not really that good. So let's go again. Sync with body, boost attack by 200. Sync with heart, boost, uh, reduce damage by 25%. Give that to Naruto. You already know why. Damage reduction is insanely good if it's the type that's advantage to you, right? So I'm going to give that to Naruto. Now... Uh, going back, uh, going back, <laughs> if I could get back, anyway, so going back to like, you know, my original statements and everything like that, um, Sasuke is the better unit, I'm sorry, and the reason why I say that is, you could argue Naruto's the better unit, Max duped, but the thing is, the chances of you having them both Max duped is like, almost impossible, 
number one. Number two, most people aren't going to have these units max duped anyways. So the unit that doesn't need dupes near as much is Sasuke. So he wins that. Not to mention his Jutsu and Ultimate both have way more utility. And I get it that Naruto does have healing and he's cooling off. But with Kaguya running around, with um, Madara running around, there's not that much need for Naruto as there is for Sasuke on the body team. So I'm going to have to give that to Sasuke. I'm sorry. I know a lot of people might feel some type of way, but whatever. You can feel that way. Um, also, another thing. The, the impacts that are coming out. Naruto's impact is heart. Sasuke's impact is skill. If you pull Sasuke, you can use Sasuke to get Naruto's impact character. And then you can use the Naruto impact character to be Sasuke's impact. Because Sasuke's skill and Naruto, um, the anniversary Naruto and impact Naruto are both heart. That's just a plan that you could do. I might make a video talking about it more in depth later on. I don't know. But anyways, so yeah, that's going to be it for this video. Be sure to give it a like. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Comment down below. Tell me what you guys think in the comment section below. With that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.